morning, my loves. I hope you guys are all well. I don't have a message as such. I got a channel song that came through as I was getting ready this morning. Um, and it was Brian Adams, Please Forgive Me. I won't sing to you guys. It's far too early to start gracing you all with my voice. Um, so we won't do that. But I just want to see, please forgive me, Brian Adams, what's this about? What is the message that's coming through, please? What is the message coming through? I still feel like there's a sense of lightness. Oh, ten of, ten of pentacles. Happily ever after. Okay, what are we doing with this? Nine of Pentacles. Okay. <laughs> the energy that I'm getting, whoever I'm connecting in with, I just want to like give you a round of applause. You have leveled the F up. You have leveled the F up. You have overcome challenges, obstacles, heartbreak. You have overcome it. And you have fiercely, fiercely been working on yourself. Working on yourself, bossing up in your own energy, stepping into your own independence, stepping into your own success, stepping into your own abundance, where you are creating this for yourself. And I just want to do that. There is someone whether this is someone that you're wanting to reconnect with or not, there is someone here that is feeling very, very confused. Someone here was very indecisive when it came to you and they were torn between their head and their heart and they followed their head. They went with what they thought other people would want what other people would accept and not accept, and they chose to neglect their heart, which has left them feeling like this. Five of Cups energy. They can feel the loss that they gave up. They walked away from you. They chose a different path. They chose a different direction. And this person now sees you and sees your level up, sees your growth, sees your success, and is kicking themselves now. Please forgive me. This person's wanting to come back for another chance. Let's see. It's very interesting how I've like kind of placed these cards as well. All right. What is this person's intentions? They're still very confused. They're still very confused. This person's trying to juggle way too many things. Whenever I see the two of pentacles, it's the juggler. This person is trying to juggle too many things. They could feel a little all over the place. I don't feel like they they fully understand what their intentions are because of the confusion. I feel like this person is viewing you like you wouldn't want you wouldn't want them back. Like I'm getting the energy, it's like they want to come towards you, but they don't even know if that's something that you would want. Like, do you want me to come towards you? Like, do you, want, do you want to talk to me? They're juggling their life at the moment. Their pentacles, their work, their family, life balance. They're, they're up in the air at the moment and they're trying to 
piece their life together. But there's a part of them where perhaps they look, they look at you in, in some way. And it's almost like they see, they see what this would have been, could have been, woulda, coulda, shoulda. What are their intentions? Ace of Pentacles. They see growth with you. They see a new beginning with you. They see that they can have success with you. Mm. Ace of Wands. Ace of Pentacles. They want a new beginning with you. This person, this person wants a new beginning with you. They see... It's almost like they can see uh, there is a lot of passion, there's a lot of creativity that, that it's almost like that you both can grow together. I don't know if you want it. You might feel very hesitant about this. I don't know if you want it. person that we're connecting in with do do they want it do you want it do you want it three of wands you're you're so focused on you you're so focused on your path that it's almost like you trust that what comes in comes in for a reason but you're so focused on what it is that you're creating in your own field that it's not you're not distracted by this energy like this is this is beautiful you're not distracted by this energy this energy now is going through tower moments this energy now is going through some challenges and then they're almost like being made to feel in their heart where they were operating from their head. Now they're being made to feel, feel their emotions, reflect what they walked away from and now they're kicking themselves. But it's still very up in the air. This person's still not necessarily grounded in, they're not necessarily sure in what they want. They see potential. Aces are potentials. They see the potential of what this could be. I'm just, <clears throat> what is it that you want? What is it that you want? <laughs> Queen of Wands. Queen of Pentacles. Like, you're like, I, I am, yeah, you are so focused on your success. You're so focused on your pentacles. You are so focused on being so financially independent, creative, successful. You are so focused on what it is that you're doing that it's almost like you have boundaries in place. You, Whoever I'm connecting in with, my word, you know your worth. You have stepped into this. You are creating the life you have always envisioned and once upon a time you may have envisioned it with this person but this person chose different this person chose different oh i'm really really excited about this energy that you're sitting in really excited hi baba um Okay, this person deceived themselves. This person deceived themselves in this in this connection. They could have. This person could have lied to you. This person could have. Well, what's this seven of swords? What's this seven of swords? What's the seven of swords? This person wasn't willing to work on it. There was something about this person wasn't willing to work. Their focus was elsewhere. Their focus was elsewhere and it wasn't focused on 
it wasn't focused on the potential of this connection. This, this, this person wasn't focused on growing this. There was something around they weren't committed to this the way you were committed to it. This connection required a bit of work. There was something here that it required work and it was almost like it was too hard. So they walked away. What's the Seven of Swords? Seven of Swords. One more place for the Seven of Swords. One more. They literally, wow. I don't really read reversals, but the fact that this has come out both reversed, it's literally like they self-sabotage their Four of Wands and their success when they chose to go down a path. Well, why did they choose that path? Spirit, why did they choose to go down that path? Because we have a choice. Yeah, we have free will. This person chose to go down a different path instead of growing this with you. Why did they choose that? Oh, Knight of Wands. That's my player card. That's player energy. That's passion. They followed... Uh, I'm not going to say that. 11-11. I'm not going to say that. They followed their excitement. They followed their excitement over following their heart. They decide to choose. Uh, other experiences. Over. Having it all with you. And now they see that. Yikes. Okay. Yeah. Ace of Swords. Now they see that. Now there's that breakthrough. What's this person going to do next? What's their next movement? What are they going to do next? The Death Card. Three of Pentacles. They may suggest working with you. There is communication. Eight of Wands. Six of Cups. They want to talk about the past. I feel like they want to try and correct the past. Lovers at the bottom of the deck with the King of Wands, but the King of Wands is upside down. Queen of Wands is upright. This could be your divine counterpart, but they were a bit of a silly bugger and chose to go tamper with other experiences where it put them in not their divine masculine energy. Okay, this person's coming back in. This person's coming back in. What's your advice for the person watching? What's your advice for the person watching, please, Spirit? Okay, we've got Nine of Cups. You just keep focusing on your wishes. You just keep focusing on your wishes. Whoa, Queen of Cups. You have three of these queens here. So it's almost like you've like you're mastering your pentacles, you're mastering your creativity, you're mastering your your intuitive, um, nurturing, emotional state with your wishes being granted because you're working on creating yourself to be in alignment. You're coming from a place of alignment and this is why all of this is happening for you. This is why all your manifestations are coming in for you. Keep focusing on you. If this person is coming towards you for the right reasons, the universe will grant because this may be a wish, wish of yours. This will be granted. But this person must be in alignment to match your energy. To match your energy this person needs to sort their shit out. And at the moment, everything's a little bit juggling for them right now. This could be slow moving for them. Don't you slow down for anything. You keep going. Keep going. 